guys, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how I do my sweat proof gym makeup. This is for all of you guys out there that are on the go, that need to run errands before and after the gym. It really just locks in your makeup all day long. Plus, you never know who you're going to run into, so you always want to have your best face forward. And let's get started. All I've done so far is cleanse and moisturize. To moisturize, I use the Fresh Lotus Youth Preserve Face Cream with Super 7 Complex. This stuff is awesome. It's lightweight, so it's great under makeup, and I use it morning and night. For foundation, I'm going to use the Makeup Forever HD Foundation in N127. This stuff is awesome because it's lightweight, it has great coverage, and it's long-lasting. I'm going to moisturize my lips while I put on the rest of my makeup. I'm going to use Nivea's Lip Butter, Vanilla, and Macadamia Kiss. I love the way that this thing smells. To conceal my under eyes and to highlight, I'm going to use Maybelline's Instant Age Rewind in Light Pale. I love this stuff. As you can tell, it is well loved. I am down to the last probably couple uses and I ripped off the top because I just don't like the sponge applicator. I just twist it up and put it on my hand and then apply with my finger. I just feel like it applies so much better. To blend out the concealer, I'm going to use a, a Sigma Tapered Kabuki F86. And to set that, I'm going to use the Ben Nye Luxury Powder in Banana. This stuff is awesome because it's finely milled and it really helps to lock in that concealer and keep it from creasing. I'm going to use the Sigma Powder Blush Brush in F10 to set that. To set the rest of my face, I'm going to use this MAC Mineralize Skin Finish in Medium Plus. And as you can tell, this is well loved as well. I'm going to use a duo fiber stippling brush to set that. I'm just going to dust it lightly all over. Can I just talk about my mug real fast? It says, Donut Ever Let Me Go. It has a donut on the inside. So cute. I got it from Target. It was only like three bucks. So awesome. To put some color back into my face, I'm going to use the Smashbox Bronze Light Skin Perfecting Bronzer in Suntan Matte. And to do that, I'm going to use the Sonia Kashuk number 113 brush. It's an angled contour brush and it's really flimsy, so I like to just use it to bronze up my face all over. It's not really great for a hard contour, but great for a regular bronze all over. And I'm also going to put it on my temples and on my forehead and on my chin and my jawline just to define it a little bit more. For blush, I'm going to use Max Melba. This is my favorite blush of all time. I use it almost every day. I'm going to use another Sigma powder blush brush to put that on my cheeks. And I'm just going to sweep it back towards my hairline. Next, I'm going to do a little bit of contour on my nose. I'm going to use Benefits Hula. I'm going to use a MAC 224 to put that on my nose. I'm only going to do a little bit. I only do this because I think it looks really weird that the rest of my face has a lot of color, but there's like zero color on my nose. And I bring it all the way up to the brow. Next, I'm going to do brows. I think it's really important because it really frames your face. And right now it looks like I have no brows. First, I use the Brow Wiz. And then I set it with the powder. And then, to really lock those bad boys in, I use the 
tinted brow gel. It really locks in your brows all day long, even when you're sweating. Brows on fleek or not? Nah? No! No more. Good thing I have a backup. Brand new. And to keep those hairs in place and to make it a little bit more hair-like, I'm going to use the brow gel. Brows done and on to eyes. I'm going to do something simple, something just to define the eyes a little bit. I'm going to use the Lorac Pro palette. I'm going to be using taupe for the crease on my MAC 224. For the lid, I'm going to be using the light bronze color. I'm just going to apply it with my ring finger. I'm just going to blend that out with the same MAC 224 that I used in my crease earlier. I want to define my eyes a little bit more so I'm going to use this Makeup Forever Aqua Eyes Eyeliner Pencil. It's a black pencil, the color is 0L. It's waterproof, so it's gonna stay on all day, even with sweat running down your face. And I'm gonna smudge that out with a Morphe flat shader brush. You can definitely tell the difference between the eye with eyeliner and the eye without. For the bottom lash line, I'm gonna use this Brimmel Scandal Eyes eyeshadow stick in Bad Girl Bronze in 003. I forgot to say that this is waterproof, so that's awesome. I'm also locking it in even further by putting the eyeshadow over it, so it's not going anywhere. I'm gonna go back into the taupe with a Morphe 156 to smudge that out. To finish off the eyes, I'm going to coat my lashes heavily with this L'Oreal Paris Hydrofuge Voluminous Carbon Black Mascara. Uh, I love that it's waterproof and it really stays all day long. And last but not least, I'm going to line my lips and fill them in with this NYX Lip Liner in Nude Pink. It lasts through drinking water at the gym and it just adds a little bit of color so you don't look so dead. To really set everything in, I'm going to use the L'Oreal Paris Infallible Pro Spray and Set Makeup Extender Setting Spray. This stuff is awesome and it's pretty much the only setting spray that you can find at the drugstore. I got mine at CVS and I'm just gonna do a couple X and T motions and my makeup will be set all day. This is the finished look. That wraps up this video. I hope you guys liked it. If you did, please thumbs up. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. I will have all the products listed down below. Please let me know what your favorite waterproof and sweatproof makeup are. I'm always interested in finding new products and switching up my routine. Now I'm off to the gym and it's leg day, so please wish me luck and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.
blush. <laughs> uh, I'm going to put blush. I'm gonna put. I'm going to put blush on. Brows on. Brows on fleek or not?